impressive. Um, I can't begin to say how delighted I am that we're doing this event tonight. My name is Marie Phillips. I'm the founder and owner of Next Steps Planning with IPC Securities. I'm sponsoring this event tonight and and thank you. And, and the one that's coming up um, with the Hamilton Philharmonic, the full orchestra and the band on February the 11th. And, um, you know, so Neil asked me to come up tonight and don't worry, I'm just going to be a couple minutes. I really want to see the music too. The music Not too. short, but sweet. And um, <laughs> my sisters are here and they're like, they're going to time me and then. <laughs> For sure, she's not going to be in it. There's no way. Give her a microphone. You're screwed. <laughs> I know, it's hard being a middle sister. Oh. <laughs> um, at any rate, um, so <laughs> Next Steps Planning, what is it? I'm actually not here to talk about what my company is. Um, we're Wealth Advice. Um, I've been in the industry now 30 years, and um, investments are a little difficult to talk about right now anyway. Um, but really, I wanted to talk tonight about um, my why. You know, like, why do you see Next Steps Planning? on posters and things around town with music. Well, you know, if it's what I did better as an amateur musician, it's what I would be doing. So I think, that, you know, I applaud everybody that is up on the stage tonight and in the audience that does this professionally. But, you know, really, um, my why boils down to two things. One is financial literacy. So in the back, you'll see a book called Financial Success for Women Written by Women or Woe Men. <laughs> written by a pro men. Um, it, it applies to men as well, but there, there are some things in there for women. If you want a copy, um, grab my business card on the way out. Uh, we'll enter you in the draw and, um, and whatnot. And, and the other reason that I'm here tonight is to talk about you know purpose. And that, a lot of that comes down to philanthropy. And my why and why I support the arts in music um, and whether it's it's uh, the fine arts, one of my sisters, uh, artist and teacher with the Dundas Valley Ooh. School of Art, an amazing charitable organization here. In Hamilton. Um, when I moved to Canada, I grew up in the north end of Hamilton and took violin lessons, so which is part of why I like supporting the Hamilton Philharmonic and the um, yeah, absolute HPO today. Flowers. So, um, and, and if you want to, if you have more than enough money to live on, you know, money needs to have a purpose. It shouldn't be sat on like a, a pile of gold, like Rumpelstiltskin. Um, we wanted to put it to work, right? So for me, that's why I like the arts. It's for me has been a life-saving thing. And whether you're using your money, which obviously I can help you, you know, direct your tax dollars into charities, uh, hopefully arts organizations like uh, the Westdale and Hamilton Music Collective, the Hamilton Philharmonic is also you know donating your time right so a lot of volunteers here tonight you can volunteer with the westdale you know i first met darcy hepner um, when he was performing at the fire hall in ancaster and i'm part of the hamilton all-star jazz band organization who you can also see here at the annual fundraiser on february 14th and you can see here how the arts organizations in Hamilton have really banded together, and I think that's a real positive out of all the, the, the awfulness of the last couple of years. So whether you're donating your time um, uh, by volunteering, I particularly like sitting on some of the arts boards here, again, working with um, the Hamilton Music Collective with Darcy, the All-Stars, and uh, the Westdale Group. So again, and, and this amazing uh, theater is a charitable organization, your community hub, so I do encourage you to uh, to show them the, uh, the love, especially here in February. So, um, yeah, thank you. Woo! Almost done. So again, I started. I first met Darcy as I said a few years ago, and um, so this past summer, he uh, he calls me or texts me or something. He says, "I have this idea. Um, let's grab coffee," which is apparently a thing with Darcy and his coffee. Um, and uh, at any rate, uh, we got talking and, and look at what has happened tonight. Like fantastic. So um, when Darcy calls and he says he has an idea, I just have two words, and that is, "I'm in." Yeah. So um, anyway, so Darcy is, he's an accomplished um, performing artist, um, arranger, as you'll see with some of the pieces tonight, um, academic here in Hamilton, and um, looking forward to seeing what he's put together tonight. So thank you again, and when you're done, uh, go on over and see our other board member at the Snooty Fox across the road. So have a great one. Thank you again. Bye.